What's up everyone, it's Vlad here again today with another video. Today I'm going to go uh, over the new Token song, uh, it's called Token Diss, so I am uh, I feel like this is going to be more like a, he's just making fun of himself type track, uh, or maybe he's like putting himself in the perspective of his haters or something like that. I don't know, I don't know anything about it, I know there's a video too as well that we're going to be watching, uh, I'm excited, I haven't heard. Uh, I mean, he just dropped High Heels. I wasn't as big of a fan as High Heels as I was about uh, the previous one, Chit Chat. Chit Chat was great. Uh, so I'm excited to see what he does with this. Sad the album got pushed back. Uh, if you don't know, he had uh, sampling issues. So the album got pushed back, which sucks. But uh, once that comes out, we definitely are going to be doing a review of that. Um, speaking of music... Uh, I just dropped a new song with uh, Tekiven, uh, an old friend of mine. I've done a couple songs with him now. Uh, it's a remix of my song Depression, which was off the Mental EP uh, that released last Friday. Uh, everything from that song is going directly to charity. Uh, we're donating it directly to the ADAA, the Anxiety and Depression Association of America, uh, in honor of Depression Awareness Month. So please go run those numbers up. It's the previous video before this. And without further ado, let's jump right into this. Outside of the crib is two women to tank top. She opened the door and that give him a name drop. She opened the top and I found me a range while we looking like her. I just got him a paint job. She looking for love and she making the paint stop. She hop on the tee. She now looking for train stop. Stop talking to T. It's tea time to take off. We don't play around. Plus this crib six more times wide than a game stop. Told grind like limelight never paid off. Those thighs fit quite right where the chain off. Two pounds to a dime. I used to cut tree down like a chainsaw. Thighs wide but I put her ankles on my cheekbones. I'm looking up at her toes like the gods say. Oh bitch had curly hair like Jack Harlow but now I got different options. What's poppin'? First of all, that, that Jack Harlow line, line was hard. He fucking said, he said, uh, Old Butch had curly hair like Jack Harlow. Jack Harlow has curly hair. Uh, but now I got different options. What's poppin'? Jack Harlow's song, What's Poppin'? Uh, that was great. Um, I'm liking his... I like... This is why I like Token. He has a, a lot of his flows are more, like, laid back. Like, he's not screaming at the microphone or anything like that. He's just kind of like... Especially now. Nowadays, he's, a lot, like, a lot more laid back. Uh, which is great. I love it. I love his flow like that. Uh, his beats are always super like weird. I feel like I feel like they're most of his beats like are specific for his fucking flow and stuff like that. Like I feel like if you gave this his, some of his beats to another person, it probably wouldn't fit nearly as much. Which so, anyways. <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh <laughs> just the way he said goofy and looked at the fucking camera that's funny I this is also why I like token token doesn't take himself seriously like he like he used to take I feel like he used to take himself like super seriously like a lot of people do like sometimes I do I make songs for like anime type shit that song and stuff like that but like a lot of people take themselves too too seriously and tokens like the polar opposite of that now and he's always preaches like he's always he's always talking about that he's like dude i'm just doing this for the fuck of it for fun now at this point like and he is like there's not a lot to sit here and dissect in this besides just talking about his flow which is like that's like that's obviously always great um but like like he's literally just saying i write words about pussy and you get no pussy pussy like like there's not much to dissect there it's pretty fucking straightforward uh but it's good like he ma he makes it so that it still sounds good I line all the way down two blocks people parked just to see the height of my rooftop laying on the ground look at the ceiling like Tupac cause the chandelier look like a nose ring to me she's been acidated that's crazy to us dog she get bitch faded that ain't what I love dog we get instigated that ain't what I shoot for she get imitated that's why it's a new flow that's why it's a new tone y'all look at you tone deaf hop out of the rose like beat back to the beast that's T back with a reset she back on the freak 
sex, put ass on my chest, spread legs to my head. Now I feel like I'm rocking a V neck. I feel like I'm the chosen one. I feel like every time <laughs> I feel like I'm rocking a V neck. Because fucking, uh, the way he was describing the position, it's like a shirt, like her legs are the V. Yeah, you get it. Just talk this, because I keep getting better and better, and anyone who was anyone gonna notice it. She got me so excited. 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 Four four when we stack more most really coco when it knows that a hoe so heavy. I don't think she wanna introduce a friend of me because she already know I'm so friendly. I don't know though, get me choke so heavy, yeah. My name's so heavy when I say it, then it make the combo so edgy. My hood too tight, my coat so Kenny Dog, little bitch of bone like go go fetch. All y'all shit played out, y'all goofy, too deep playing yourself, y'all boosy, nootsy, only moving up, got some who one, got some who the one, got bros moving sus, don't know who to trust, my clothes new enough, my glow too up, too new, too big, too me, too teeth, not talking his teeth. Yeah. She got me so excited. Not talking his teeth. She got me so excited. She got me so excited. I definitely did do like this video though. Like, his last couple of videos have been fucking phenomenal. Like, like actual production and stuff like that. Not him just walking down the street rapping. Uh, which, those were good too. But, uh, this one's just like... Literally, this song is about fucking nothing. And, but it sounds good. And that's what, like I was saying, that's what Token's been doing a lot uh, recently. He's like, he's just rapping. Especially with uh, his uh, High Billy, High uh, Tyler... Stuff like that. That shit. Uh, he made a high Tyler, right? He did Billie Eilish, J. Cole. No, he did He did do a high Tyler. I remember that now. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, that's what he had the pink hoodie on. Um, but, like, like, I'm reading the lyrics right now. It's not too much to actually, like, dissect here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but I'm very hyped for his new album. Like, 100%. I cannot wait for his new album. Um, I feel like it's going to be a lot of bangers. I think Chit Chat was the first single off of the album. Or Dentures. One of those. Chit Chat or Dentures. Uh, I know uh, he was talking about that. I'm, I'm very hyped to see what he, he comes up with for this. Because I know he's been working on it for a while. Um, adding new shit uh, over time and shit like that. Um, this song, overall, this song was pretty good. I, I thought it was going to be more like him... Uh, Literally just fucking dissing himself. Uh, and shit like that. But he said something about it. Hold on. Let me find him. Scrolling through. I have the lyrics up on another screen. Um. It's like every song, uh, feels like a diss to me. Yeah, I feel like every song is a token diss. Uh, some of that. So he's, uh. He's taking offense to everything type of deal, I guess. But yeah, um, that's going to be it for this video. It's going to be a shorter video because I am in the middle. Like, I literally just came home from work and jumped on my computer to record this. And I had to go to my other job now because I have two jobs outside of music and shit like that. Um, so, definitely good song. I'm going to leave the description to the original video uh, down below. Uh, make sure you go check out uh, Depression Remix featuring to Kevin. Uh, all, like I said before, all revenue proceeds, all that stuff goes directly to ADAA. Uh, it's good charity, good cause. Uh, spreads awareness, so spread it around. Um, all that fun stuff. Um, and oh, another announcement, another announcement before before I go. Uh, I am working on a cipher uh, called the MA cipher, the Massachusetts cipher, uh, with me. T Kevin's gonna be on it, I believe. Uh, Young Ace might be on it. We're still talking about that. Some other people I've worked with in the past and some people that I haven't worked with before. Uh, basically a bunch of artists from Massachusetts and uh, stay tuned for that because that's going to be dope. Uh, giving everyone a chance to like mix fan bases, meet each other, uh, shout outs to anything that they like to do. Um, yeah, so without further ado, uh, peace out.